Hey guys, welcome to my first hair care review. <laughs> Mother's doing big things. <laughs> I'm really excited. This is so crazy. I'm really excited about this. Well, today's review, um, I will be covering this new hair care product line called, <laughs> I keep on trying to call it, or I keep on wanting to call it emergency. I don't know why. I've seen that commercial a couple times, but I don't know why. Anyway, um, it's called Emerge. I don't know if you can see it. I'll give you a better close up within this video. Emerge specifically made these hair care products for people with very thick, curly hair so if you are somebody who has like thick natural hair or just curly hair i don't know do non black people call it natural anyway they sent it for somebody like me because obviously i have this texture i have 4c and 3b 4b right four, i don't even know the numbers because you know i really don't get into that but you know what this isn't about <laughs> how I number my hair because I just don't like it. It feels, mm, we'll get into that in another review. I don't really do the numbers thing with my hair, but for this review, I will say I have 4C hair texture in the back all the way up to here. And I think it's called 3B with like looser curls up here. This is more um, of my hair that has been heat damaged, unfortunately. When I used to wear a lot of um, sew and weaves, I will leave this section of hair out and this would this section of hair will get pressed the most. And I don't know why guys, but I've been natural now for about eight, eight or nine years. And I've chopped off all of my, you know, heat damaged hair, even the front. But this, my hair still grows in, in this texture. So it's still like heat damaged texture. I don't know if I damage like my scalp somewhere i don't know but i've cut this thing all the way down so i had like you know a steve harvey fade and it still has grown back like this so i don't know if you guys know why let us just know but anyway these hair care products are specifically made for people with my hair texture so that's why influencer i got it right i've been trying to say that name so many times in this video y'all don't even know how much i have cut out uh, shout out to Influencer who uh, sent your girl these hair products. Thank you guys. Check me out on Influencer. I am Nikki Star. So I just looked up my natural hair texture just to make sure like I was giving you guys the right information. Because again, I don't do the numbers, but I'm doing this video and I wanted to make sure that I, you know, am being as helpful as I can be. Um, so I looked up my hair texture and guys, I'm ranging from 3B in the front all the way down to 4C. So I went natural, like I said, about eight years ago, eight or nine years and ago. And I've only pressed my hair out all the way through fully, front to back, about three times. So since I've gone natural nine years, oh no, 10. Wow, actually 10, hallelujah. 10 years ago, the back of my hair has only been pressed about three times. And so back here, it's um, the curls are a bit tighter and um, I have to do a lot of extra moisturizing back here because my hair is very, the coils are very, very tight and it's really hard for moisture to get in there. So back here, I'm about a 4C. Then as I come up to the middle of my hair, I am more of like a 4A about right here because this is how curly it's going to get. This right here. This is more of a 4A. And then right here, this mixture, it goes from like four, it's like a mixture of like 4A, 4B, and 3B. It's very weird. Like there's so many textures up here. So I'm hoping that, and, it's, and I'm putting a lot on this brand. I'm hoping that these products can at least give me some kind of formation all the way around. Like just some, some unity within my curls. We'll see. It doesn't say that it does that, but I'm just saying for me, I would hope and I would like to see that if um, it's possible. Because this product says that it was made for natural hair and one of its goals is to moisturize natural curls. So we will see if Emerge gets all of this moisture in my hair, what my curls are gonna look like. I'm hoping for some kind of unity that makes my hair look like it's on the head of one person and not like six different people. We will see. We will see. So now let's get into the product. So I received my products 
and this cute influencer box that I showed you earlier. I received their shampoo, which is not called a shampoo, okay? This shampoo is for curly and coily textures. I have both and then some. It's also a cleansing and detangling shampoo. That's another thing that I really, really need with my hair because with having so many different textures, when I wash my hair, it is just like, it, it's a nightmare. It's, it's a naughty nightmare. This shampoo was also infused with almond milk and it says it's for moisture rich frizz free curl definition nothing about unity but again we're hoping for a miracle <laughs> it's formulated without sulfates parabens phthalates and silicones what the hell is a phthalate let me look that up okay so i looked up oh you know what how how does it pronounce how, do, how should i pronounce it dictionary.com phthalate oh Folate. So I looked up folate. The definition says it's a salt or ester of a phylactic acid. I appreciate a company that is looking into issues like that that could affect someone like me and looking into products that are being used um, within, you know, hair care products and are just saying, we want something that's very safe and clean and something that our consumer can use without potential health risks. I think that's a great idea. I really appreciate this company for even going uh, the extra mile because you really don't have to if you want to make a buck in the United States of America. You know what I mean? And just as long as it's like approved by our minimal laws, you're good. But the fact that they chose to do something like that, I, I don't know. As for, for me, I thought that was pretty cool and it would make me want to, you know, look more into this brand, even if something didn't work for me the fact that they are really focused on making sure that their hair care products are, you know, the safest that they can be and going the extra mile. I appreciate it. Now, the next thing that I got was the Smooth Mover Conditioner um, for Corally Coily Textures. Here it is. Again, I'm gonna put a close up of all of these products in the video. It says that this um, conditioner moisturizes and softens the hair made with almond milk. I love that because I'm an almond milk hoe. Um, uh, for moisture rich, frizz free, curl defining, same thing. No sulfates, no harsh sulfates. Put that in there. No parabens, phylates, or silicones. Love that. Love that. And then I got this, which is the Emerge Back to Life Hair Mask. Now, I love this. It says that this hair mask deep conditions and revives. Once again, infused with almond milk, same thing. Now this hair mask states that it doesn't have any sulfates, any parabens, any phylates or silicones. Wait a minute, hold on. So the conditioner is the only one that has sulfates, but they say that it's free of harsh sulfates. Everything else does not have sulfates in it. Emerge, you're doing good with me so far, baby. So, I, oh, Lord, I hope these products work because I'm liking this company. I'm really liking this company. And I also got this from Influencer, which is just a bit of information about Emerge. So let me read it to you. Introducing Emerge, a new brand of clean hair care products designed for the natural girls, just as innovative as her coily, curly, and wavy styles. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Whether it's braids, twist outs, or a well-defined wash and go, her creativity shines through with every hairstyle she rocks. Ooh. I hope this is a black brand. Because <laughs> I'm just like, you know, if it's not, if it's not black owned, you got the right people in place because you're saying the right things for the sisters. Powered by almond milk and pecky oil. Now, guys. Because listen, especially when I'm like reviewing stuff, I look up everything. So pecky oil. Pecky oil is a seed oil extracted from the seeds of Carioca brasilianese, which is a native of Brazil. Brazilian subscribers, forgive me. I, you know, I tried. I tried. I tried to say that right. I'm an American. My tongue is colonized. Y'all know how I go. Uh, and pecky oil is high in vitamin A and it's an emollient. So that means that it's like deeply moisturizing. It kind of has the consistency of olive oil. You know how olive oil is like a multi-use oil because it's very thick and it also latches on to like its surface. So I use olive oil for almost everything. I cook with it. I use it in my hair. I, um... <laughs> 
when mother ain't got no money, sometimes, you know, a little bit of hand lotion. It is what it is. You got to be creative. I'm from the hood. We don't waste nothing. Anyway, um, so, so it's like a really thick oil that's high in uh, vitamin A. It also is an emollient, like I said before, so it's very thick and it latches on, which is why they decided to use this oil, especially for curly hair, because it's so thick and heavy and moisturizing. It is supposed to keep your curls and like your hair defined in its natural texture without all of the frizz. If you're a natural girl and you wear your hair natural 24 seven, not under protective styles, you know, you know that after about two or three days, that twist out is done. <laughs> the frizz demon just comes and messes up the hair, especially when you're working out. I know a lot of us have started like new workout plans and you know, it's January, the beginning of a new year and we're trying to kick it in gear, which is why my hair looks like this because I just left a high intensity class at my gym that I just joined. So my hair is frizzy and dry. So Becky oil from my research is a really good oil for, you know, naturally curly hair. I'm going to be looking in uh, to buying it. I don't know where I can find it. I was like searching, you know, hopefully it's on Amazon because, oh shoot. I gotta cancel my uh, Amazon Prime. I ain't got that $14. Anyway, <laughs> you know what? It's a new season. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it because I shop at Amazon so much. And you know, <laughs> anyway, Pecky Oil is a main ingredient in all of these products. The product line, um, from what I found, from what uh, influencer sent me, and just looking into every product, Pecky Oil is like one of the main um, ingredients, which is good which is really, really good. Now I've also found that almond milk is also one of the main ingredients because it says here, it's powered by almond milk and pecky oil. Emerge keeps your curls and coils moisturized and defined. Our moisture rich products are formulated with no nasties. Is this a black brand? Free of sulfates, parabens, phylates, silicones, mineral oil. Well, not free of sulfates. The conditioner is free of harsh sulfates but you know, they let you know. This product is also free of mineral oil and dyes. With the Emerge Collection, naturals are free to be themselves and embrace their carefree curls naturally. Who owns this brand? Our goal is to enable the next generation to embrace their creativity in every endeavor, including how they style their hair. Hmm. Huh. Who owns this? Because I was trying to look this up because I don't know about you guys, but I'm that girl who I always, before I purchase anything new, I always look up the brand, check reviews, find out who owns it before I purchase it. Because your money matters and where you spend it matters. Stay woke. So I tried to like look up this company. I couldn't find anything. And I think it's because this is a really brand new company. They do not have a website, but they are uh, located and um, sold in Target. I saw a post about them on Refinery29. Allure wrote positive things about them. And from the reviews on Target, a lot of people enjoyed this product. A lot of people said that they really liked how this product worked for their hair. So I'm excited. Really interested to see what these products do for my hair. I told you guys before, I'm looking for a hair care product line that can like moisturize my hair. And if you can give me unity within my curls, because I just, I, I have so many different textures and it, it becomes a hassle with styling and also detangling. So that's another reason why I'm really interested to see how this is gonna work for my hair, especially the it's not happening sulfate free shampoo because with having so many different textures, my hair just knots up a lot, especially in the front. My looser curls gets wrapped into my tighter curls and it's it just takes me forever to do my hair. And if this can cut that down, I would really appreciate it. But you know, if it just gives my hair moisture because I live in LA and that just means that I just live in a colonized desert. So um, the, it's, it, it's hella dry out here. I'm from Philly, so I'm not used to having to manually moisturize my hair so often, but I've been, you know, getting better at it, which is why my hair is starting to grow. So hopefully Emerge can, you know, do the impossible or just do something good enough to make life easier for me. So now <laughs> let's see what it do. Full disclosure, um, I deal with scalp psoriasis. So um, I use uh, Aveda's Promisana Purifying Scalp Cleanser. 
I am going to use this on my scalp. I do not want to stray from that because of you know what I deal with. I use this product to cleanse my scalp and then I just have a bunch of other products for um, my hair. So I use shampoo for my hair. I use the Aveda Promisana for my scalp because of the issues that I have. I also do a aloe vera hair mask that I make. I use this on my hair all the time. These are two things that I'm not straying from for um, whatever hair products that I use and review. I'm always going to use these two products because they work for my scalp with the issues that I have. I'm hoping that Emerge can, you know, give me the moisture curls that I'm looking for. You know what I mean? I have products that help my scalp. I need products that help my hair. I have been having a really hard time keeping the moisture in my hair since I moved out to LA and since I went natural. So it's just been a lot. So I'm hoping this could work with it. If not, it'll be a great review and I'll give the product to somebody to work for, but let's hope and pray that it works for me because I'm sick of looking. I want my hair to grow and I want to find a system that works for me. Let's see if it does. Okay, so I have just washed, conditioned, and used the uh, Emerge hair mask. Guys, I am thoroughly impressed. I really, really am. I went into this with not really a lot of expectations because I've never heard about this product, never used it. Shout out to Influencer. Um, and so I just really didn't know what to expect. I mean, they have, you know, what will come of this if you use this product written on the actual product, but you just never know because not everything works for your hair. Everybody knows that your hair is a specific type and something may work for this chick, may not work for you. So I just did not really expect a and lot. And I think maybe because of that, I was just really like, you know, overjoyed with my results because let's talk about this shampoo. Let me tell you something. This shampoo is the truth. Like I literally just got out of the shower, which is probably why it might look a little wet to you on a screen. This thing does exactly what it says that it is supposed to do. The It's Not Happening Soul Fate Free Shampoo says that it's for moisture rich frizz free curl definition cleansing and detangling infused with almond milk let me tell you something it did that it did that baby I, when i i don't know what my results are going to be because i haven't taken my hair down but when i was washing my hair first of all <laughs> a little goes a long way when i was washing my hair i used too much i believe because it was like a sudsy nightmare <laughs> Like it was suds all over my shower and it was just, it, it just got everywhere. So I used a little bit on the other side of my hair because I part my hair into sections. Like I said before, I have several different textures, so I cannot wash my hair all together because it will get the uh, tangled. So I have to like section off my hair and wash it. And this side was the real sudsy one. And this one was what I used just a dollop of shampoo and I still got the same result. So a little goes a long way which is another thing that I love. If I'm using a product, it needs to be affordable. It needs to be something that works really well for my hair, but it also needs to be something that I can maintain financially and have on rotation. If it's something that's like $50 for a freaking shampoo, I'm not doing it. I'm finding a cheaper alternative, even if I have it. You know what I mean? Because let me tell you something, I'm a working actress out here, so that means that I'm broke half the year. But when, you know, when I do get booked and busy, I like the finer things in life and I will splurge, but I'm not splurging on a $50 shampoo, especially for something that I cannot keep up right now. And even if I have it and I find something that can give me the same, if not better results for $7, I'm using that one. So I put the shampoo on my hair and for it to be a sulfate free shampoo, I got a lot of suds which is really good because a lot of my sulfate free shampoos don't like suds up like this, but this uh, shampoo did uh, give me a lot of suds, which I like, you know, it's that mental thing. It's suds and up, it makes you think that your hair is getting cleaner than it probably is. But I like that, you know, I like that illusion, that sudsy illusion. So after I figured out the right amount to use for my hair, started uh, just, you know, massaging the uh, product through my hair, because as you know, I use um, Aveda's Promisana for my scalp. And then I use just a regular shampoo to just shampoo my hair. So I use a different cleanser for my scalp and I use a different uh, cleanser for my hair. This product made my hair feel so good, guys. Like I could feel it like instantly detangling and moisturizing. It says that it cleanses, detangles, and moisturizes. 
I felt all of those things. I'm like, I'm a bit shocked, right? Because rarely do products do what they say that they're going to do. It's either one thing, one promise from that product that comes to pass, not everything. Like I really feel like this company did its research. I was saying that when I was washing, washing my hair, I was just like, you guys really did your research because for you to say that your product does this and it actually does it, I'm really impressed because guys, you, we all know that that doesn't happen all the time. You know what I mean? Like I really felt my hair being detangled. I really felt my hair being moisturized. And even when I wash out the shampoo, I could still feel the moisture. That's another really important thing for me. I don't ever want my hair to feel stripped. I hate that. I don't want squeaky clean hair. I want the heaviness and the weight and the dirt of, you know, this environment out of my hair. But I also want to be able to still feel my hair, feel the moistures, the natural moistures in my hair. And I was also able, right after I washed it, to like finger detangle. I'm not at the, with my hair, I'm not at the finger detangling process until I actually put on detangler. And that's after I shampoo and wash my hair. So I'm really impressed with this shampoo. What it says it's supposed to do, it does. So shout out to Emerge because you did the damn thing with this. Now let's talk about this conditioner. I will say this shampoo has like a faint smell. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna be honest with you, it gives me like older church mother. <laughs> like this smells like old black Kojic church mother. This is what I'm, I don't know what that smell is, but this is it. And when I smell this, I get fashion fair, Easter Sunday, 55 plus, you know what I mean? Like. This is an older smell. I'm not saying that it's bad, but when I was washing my hair, I was just like, this is very age specific. I don't know what that smell is. Could it be, it's not the almond milk. Could it be, what is that um, ingredient that they said that they have in here? The pecky, pecky, whatever that is, that oil, could it be that? Maybe that's the smell, but it has a very faint, very age specific. Um, doesn't make the product bad, but I was just like, hmm, this is an older smell. Honestly, I don't like fragrances in anything. I just feel like it doesn't really help. Like, I just want a product that can work. You don't have to make it smell sweet for me to use it. You know what I mean? So you're just putting it in the product so that it could smell a certain way. You can take it out. We don't need it. Um, I'm hoping that maybe that's the pet key, that, that Brazilian nut oil that smells like that, but you don't really need, like this product works amazing. You don't need anything to like sweeten it up. It's already there. Now let's get into this conditioner, baby. The older scent that I was telling you about is magnified in this conditioner. So I told you I just got off the shower. So it's magnified in this conditioner. It hits you like a ton of bricks. Again, it's not a bad scent. It's just, it doesn't, it smells old to me. And that's not bad. For some people, it might be a bad thing, but I'm just like, this is something my grandmother would use. Yes, this is like, it's really, sorry. It's strong, it's stronger on this, uh, on the conditioner uh, than it is on the shampoo. That aside, the conditioner works great. The conditioner works great. It's thick and creamy. How I like my conditioner. Um, again, a little goes a long way. I use too much again on the left side of my hair than I should have, but a little goes a long way. Like not a lot, you know, just palm it a bit and work it through your hair. A little goes a long way. Very impressed with the conditioner, just like I was with the shampoo. I'll use it again. I'll use it again. It does what it said it was going to do. It's a smooth mover conditioner for coriolly textured hair, moisturizes and softens the hair infused with almond milk. It did that, guys. It did that for me. I, I'm telling you, what I love about Emerge is that everything that they said that they were going to do on their products, every promise came through. Can't complain. Now let's talk about the hair mask. Back to life hair mask. This hair mask deep conditions and revives once again, infused with almond milk for moisture rich, frizz free curl definition. Works for me. Like I didn't really see much of a difference or feel much of a difference from the conditioner. I think this, uh, the con 
The conditioner is thicker than the hair mask, in my opinion. The hair mask was not as thick, went on smooth. When it dried a bit, it was a little thicker, but it was pretty smooth, like a mousse in the beginning and kind of hardened as my hair dried because they said you have to leave this on your hair for about 15 minutes. I did just that. I followed all of the directions. I just, um, because this was so good, I only needed to wash my hair once. Normally I need to wash my hair at least two to three times, but this worked so well the first time, I didn't feel the need to go in and use more product on my hair and rewash my hair again. I got the results that I normally get after washing my hair two or three times in one go. This shampoo impressed the hell out of me. Out of all these products, this is my ace. This is my ace boom coom right here. Is that racist? This right here is my top pick out of all of these products. If you don't have it to get anything else, get this shampoo. I am... <laughs> in love but yeah with the hair mask i didn't see much of a difference or feel much of a difference from the conditioner i guess i won't know until i have had these products on my hair for a couple of days and see you know how much of a difference um between the conditioner and the hair mask i think the only difference for me just from the feel of it was that the uh, hair mask was a little thinner in texture than the um conditioner it has that same smell as well. I'm thinking it's the Pecky. Pequi, that, that Brazilian nut, I'm thinking it's that. Because that's toted as like the main ingredient along with almond milk in these products. But yeah, I, um, I'm impressed. I really, really am impressed. I don't have any issues. Um, I would just say, unless this scent comes or fragrance comes from the Pecky Brazilian nut oil, um, unless it comes from that, I don't think you guys need it. I really, really don't. Unless the product smells like butt. <laughs> you know what I mean? Without it, then do it. But I don't think you need it. I think you guys have a really great product here at Emerge. And I don't think you need any kind of scent or dye or anything. I, I don't think they use a dye. Yeah, they don't. They say it's free of dyes. So I don't think you need a scent to make it any more um, appealing. If you do want a scent, I would suggest you go on with a lavender or a mint. We love that on our scalps, especially in the natural hair community. So I would suggest going with something like that, but you don't need it. You got a great product. So my final results is that I highly recommend it. If I, if you can't get anything else, get this shampoo guys. I'm telling you, I was amazed with my results. And again, full disclosure, I use my aloe vera hair mask that I use my aloe vera in, um, it wasn't coconut. I don't use coconut oil on my hair. Olive oil, Lord. I used that combination on my hair before I used this product. So maybe that helped, but I use that with all of my shampoos. I use my Aveda Parmesana for my scalp. And then I use my aloe vera hair uh, mask, uh, DIY mask that I make. And I use that before I use any shampoo or conditioner. And um, I never got these results. You know, I ain't even gonna bash what I used to use but um i'm impressed i'm really impressed with this shampoo i highly recommend the shampoo um if you can afford to get the whole set i think they're all about six or seven dollars at target i would say get it i would say get the shampoo and conditioner i would also say get the hair mask and whatever other products that they have i think this is a company that you should give a shot because for me i feel like they've done their research and i'm really impressed uh with with the products. So again, shout out to Influencer because uh, you did good on this one. You did good on this one. This right here is a good pick. Highly recommend it. And I'm not getting paid. I just got the product sent to me and I didn't even have to do a video. You know what I mean? They just want you to like put up a picture and say you used it or whatever. But um, for some reason, I decided to do a video for this. And I'm glad I did because this is a really good product. So shout out to Emerge. I hope you guys become a bit more engaged because I can't find your website. Maybe you're that new. I also don't know their social media handles. I've looked, I haven't seen anything. You guys, if you're really, really new, I understand, but you need to get on it because you have a good product and there are going to be people who want more. And I would love to know who's behind it. I would love to know if it's like a natural girl like myself who was frustrated with, you know, all of these hair products that she had to use and she to try it and she decided to make her own. I would love to know what the story is. I would love uh, to know why you chose this, this kind of 
a combination what was the thought behind it i just want you know this is the time where we want to be more engaged with companies we want to know who's behind the brand the purpose behind the brand those things are very important to me and i know uh it's important to uh some of you who watch me so i would like to know more about that about emerge i'm still going to use the product <laughs> regardless if you have an instagram or not because this <laughs> shampoo highly recommend the shampoo highly recommend the shampoo so now before we wrap this review, let's take down the hair and do the fill test. I'm nervous. Ooh! Oh! Shrinkage is real, baby. But okay! Okay! Remember when I said I wanted to have like you know, unified definition between uh, my curls because there's like, there's several different hair textures. I'm not saying I got the full unity, but I'm liking the definition. I see a little bit of frizz though, but I've had, maybe it's because I've had my hair up in that towel for about, about a half an hour now. So maybe that's why, because before this I had my breakfast because it's mad early. Maybe that's why, but guys oh <gasps> maybe she's born with it maybe it's emerged <laughs> i love this i i oh my gosh my hair feels very very soft and guys remember remember i was telling you about the shampoo when i put it on i just felt like my hair was just detangling on its own it was really really weird really really weird i wish you guys could feel it my hair feels very soft. You know what? Maybe this is the result of the hair mask. If you've done it and you don't have this and you didn't do the hair mask, maybe do the hair mask. Because, baby, I normally have to put on my detangler, work my way through it before I can get here. Yes. I'm sorry, I'm looking at myself in the mirror. I can't stop. I can't stop. What do you guys think? Oh. Oh, I wish I could, like, do a fill test the only time I would let anybody touch my hair. Oh, this feels good. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I recommend it. I recommend it. I'm a believer. <laughs> they converted me. If you have used these products or if you intend on using these products, let's talk about it in the comment section below. Let me know what your results are. Let me know if you've done something different, if you had different results, if you've had better results, let us just know because I'm new to these products and I intend on using them again. I actually think I'm going to buy some for my sister and my mom because my mom is starting her natural hair journey. So I think this would be really cool to buy for the family because we're all naturals in my house now. Thank God, my mom has left the creamy crack alone. It's time, you know what I mean? She's getting older and we're just like, we don't want you putting all these harsh chemicals on your head, <laughs> you know? You ain't got the immune system that you used to have back in the day. So, so since we're all natural leases in the house now, I think this is something I might gift my family with because it's affordable. These products are like six or seven dollars and I just, I think it's worth it. You know, some of these uh, shampoos and conditioners and like all of these hair um, products for natural leases are pricey are pricey and I love to support, especially if it's a black owned brand, but sometimes I just don't have it. So if I have a really great product that is six or $7 that works amazing for my hair, I'm gonna go to that first. I'm gonna go to that first. I gotta really think about if I can afford the 16 to $20 shampoo and conditioner, you know what I mean? Like that's, that's a big ask a lot of times because if you have a lot of hair, you go through a lot of products. So Emerge, that this is gonna be my brand. I'm gonna use it a few more times before I like make it my number one. Right now, my For Curls products are my number one products. I don't know if I'm ready to knock them out of first place, but this shampoo, it may do that. We gonna see. I think I may do an update uh, maybe in a month or so to just show you guys how you know, um, my hair has responded to these products after using them uh, a few more times. So we will see, we will see. But again, if you use it, have used it, let me know what your positive or negative results are. Let me know how you improved it for yourself. Let's just chat about this product because it's a new product. It's new to me. It's probably new to a lot of you. 
I want to know what your experience is with Emerge. For me, so far, so good. So that's it for me. Thank you so much for tuning in to Nikki Star TV. And if you like what you see here, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I will see you for another review <laughs> soon and very soon. Love you much. Bye.